We're now in mid-September and I wanted to show you a couple of things in this border that have really, really grown since the spring. So if you watched any, any of my earlier videos, um, particularly the border tours, you will have seen um, how this Helianthus Lemon Queen was literally just nothing um, earlier in the year. It was literally... So this, all these stems will die, so I'll cut them right back to the ground and then I won't see them again until the spring. So you can see how it has filled out this corner and how big it is now. And it is really, really lovely. The corner, this corner looks pretty boring earlier in the year. So I don't really know how to fill the space because, because this grows here, but it is quite bare in the winter and early spring so that's something I need to think about um, but anyway it's gorgeous and a lot of these flowers in this border are going over now so all the achelia has gone to seed, Lyatris is finished um, I've got some persicaria and that's you can see that's pretty much finished now still a few achelia flowering um, and also wanted to show you this eucalyptus because I coppiced it in, I think it was March, mid-March time, and it was a very, quite a tall tree, and I cut it down to basically a stump. Again, if you see any of my videos earlier in the year, it was literally a stump, and it looked, it looked terrible. I felt like I'd committed a crime. Um, but, as you can see, it's grown back, and you can see the stump, if I show you there. So you can see where I cut it there and you can see all these side shoots, these stems have now grown and they look absolutely gorgeous. Um, so I'm hoping that I will be able to use some of these lovely stems for Christmas wreaths. Um, um, yeah, and I also got another eucalyptus which I did the same and this one's a different variety. So I think that's Parvi folia or part of Eula, I think it might be called now. And I'm not sure about this one. I think it's uh, Cinerea, the, the one that's quite commonly used in floristry. So I'm trying to get the best light. So that's really grown as well and they're both looking really healthy. So yeah.